noun sunny and the noun window it shows us where sunny is in the second sentence towards shows us the relationship between the pronoun she and the noun do it indicates the direction in which the girl is going and in the third sentence the cock crows at dawn at shows the relationship between the noun cock and the noun dawn it shows when the cock crows so children near towards and at all these three words are called as prepositions and what are they showing us near is showing us the location towards is showing us the direction at is showing us the time so what are prepositions prepositions show the relationship between a noun or pronoun and another word in the sentence now let's do exercise 1 fill in the blanks with the correct prepositions of place the words given are behind by near on under first one the king built his palace dash the banks of the river the king built his palace on the banks of the river b keep the chair dash the table answer keep the chair near the table c the tiger hid itself dash the bush behind the bush d the thief buried the gold dash a tree under a tree and e he stopped the car dash the side of the road by the side of the road so here we have answered the correct preposition of place now let's move further in question 2 you have to fill in the blanks now with correct prepositions of time the words given are at since through towards and within let's start a he has not spoken a single word dash you left since you left b you must report for work dash a month within a month c they kept awake dash the night through the night d he felt tired dash the end of the day towards the end of the day e the fairy vanished dash the stroke of the midnight at the stroke of the midnight Now let's do question three. Here you have to fill in the blanks with correct prepositions of direction. The words are across, against, along, around, and between. There is a bridge dash the river, across the river. He placed the ladder dash the wall. against the wall see there is a wall dash the two houses between the two houses he made a trip dash the world he made a trip around the world the road runs dash the banks of the river the road runs along the banks of the river Now children let's do the last part number 
underline the prepositions in the following paragraph and state their kind. What have we studied? The three kinds of preposition. Preposition of place, preposition of time and preposition of direction. So you have to read this paragraph and underline the prepositions and label them. Write PP for preposition of place, PT for preposition of time and PD for preposition of direction. So let's begin. One day a cap seller was travelling to the town to sell his caps. To is preposition of direction because he was travelling towards the town. There was a jungle on the way. On again is telling you the direction of the jungle. So on will be labelled as PD. Next sentence. At noon he got tired. At is telling you the time. So preposition of time. So he chose to lie under a tree to take rest and soon fell asleep. Under is telling you the place where he was lying. So under will be PP. Preposition of place. Next sentence. There were some monkeys living in that tree. In that tree is the place. So PP preposition of place for in. Next, they came down the tree. Down is preposition of direction. Took the caps from the basket. From is preposition of place. And went up the tree. Up again is preposition of direction. So PD. When the cap seller was awake, he was shocked to find that all the caps except the one on his head were gone. On will be preposition of place. So PP. To his surprise, he saw the monkeys on the tree wearing the caps. Again, on becomes preposition of place. PP. Disappointed, he took his own cap off his head. Off means removing it away from his head. So, it's telling you the direction. So, off is preposition of direction. And threw it at the monkeys. At means towards the monkeys. So at becomes PD, preposition of direction. Soon all the monkeys threw their own caps at the cap seller. At again becomes preposition of direction PD. The cap seller collected all the caps in his basket. In is telling you the place. So in becomes preposition of place PP. And went away happily. So here we have marked the preposition and also labeled the types. That is all for today children. Thank you.